Here we go. Garth with the new ball. There's a hint of shape away from the right-handed Matthews. Oh, catch it. In the air and through. And it will get to the rope. Lauren, you're at slip. Good you to were. see, Kim. There it is on show again. But Best Matthews is able to get that away. Desperate effort from Flintoff, but back-to-back -back boundaries. There she goes. Over the top and out. So the first wicket falls. And it is Tamari Adapadu who goes without scoring. Dooley. Nice bit of work. Very brave. Brave in a, what, fifth delivery, sixth delivery she faces. Matthews cracks that away. Nice placement. And it does run out to the rope. Rocks back beautiful. again and punches it away. That's beautiful batting. Four more for Matthews. Again, it's this, this quick footwork from Hayley Matthews. That really smart bowling from Maloney. Flat yeah. out bowled! That looked like it was there to be hit away, but Matthews misjudged the bounce. Cut away and taken! Capsi takes the catch and Molyneux falls without score. To state stuff, we always want to have the wood over them. Um, yeah, and we always play really tight games against them, which is really exciting and, and exciting for the fans to, to finally see that. Well, you'd be pleased to know there's a boundary there for I the Renegades, so... There we go. There's some real aggression from Josie Dooley, and it pays off. Three for 46. Over at 200 runs. It's WBBL. That's well struck by Dooley. And the placement again is very good. She is proving the aggressor. Try and defend... Dooley is looking really good. That's great placement again. In fact, it's Courtney Webb this time who's found that gap behind points. Who gets that away on the leg side. Flintoff is diving left, right and centre in this match, but all to no avail at the moment. Webb is scoring really freely. Three for 64. Oh, it's an outstanding wicket. I think we saw in the first game, obviously it's like chasing sort of 170, 180 to, to win second innings. It is, it's an outstanding pitch, yeah, absolutely. Full toss, belted away, could be caught, taken by Flintoff. And the umpire at square leg signals that the ball was a legitimate one. And that is the end of Courtney Webb. Be stable. Yeah, Dooley yeah. backs away. That's well placed. Yeah, it's actually quite nice. Who's more annoying on the injury front? Is it you or Wolfie? Oh, hang on. If we go back up to you guys. Catch. So the wicket falls, Leeson goes. Sutherland picks up the wicket. Around the wicket. And over the top, Kershaw finds a boundary immediately. That's nicely dealt with as well for four more. Very good gap there. That's what you want. <laughs> That's pretty well struck, but too well struck. And the catch is taken by Capsi. Maloney has four wickets for the second time in the WBBL this season. Great shot. Dooley gets it over the top. Superb. One bounce over the rope. That's a great shot from Dooley, as we said. It's the, the 50 up there. Pull shot this time. Very effective batting. Dooley's finding boundaries when the Renegades desperately need them. Coming at Sutherland, bold! Sutherland strikes back. Her third wicket, continuing this exceptional season, Annabelle Sutherland. Hit him. As Prestwich has done here, she's gone over the top and finds a boundary. Innings. Full toss. Whee. Smashed away. All the way. That's there to be hammered, and it goes over the top. Flintoff parries it for six. Prestwich deep in a crease, straight up in the air. Fulton getting under it, Garth getting under it. Garth takes the catch, her first wickets, and that is that.
149 will be the victory target for the Melbourne Stars after the enterprising late batting of Sarah Coit. And she beats Winfield Hill first up. Shocked. Well struck by Winfield Hill. Her driving is of high quality. After those matches in Mackay, Heath lost her place. It's racing out towards the boundary as well. And value for shots at the junction. This is excellent from Coit. Yeah. Now he's done a superb job. And great to see his reward for all the fantastic work he did with the Australian team. Well, there's a lot of discussion here about whether they have a look at the review, but I think time management must have just snuck it in. Original decision is not out. Pitching outside impact in line. Wickets hitting. You're on screen now. Get you to change your decision to out. I repeat, out. And this was Winfield Hill who'd been bogged down by Sarah Coit in the over. Yep. Bess Heath goes the reverse and whacks her away. There's no nicking that. That's right out of the middle. Quite got the management of that right yet. That's a shot. Down the ground for the fourth boundary of the innings. Capsi lifts Coit over the top. That international experience just brings a whole another level to it. Ooh. That's a way that'll take some chasing down. That's four. So I think she's she's one over and then gonna win. <laughs> oh, that's not. That's gone up. That should be caught. And it is taken by Hayward. And thanks to Erica Kershaw. We'll check in with her later. She's got some celebrating to do. Things though, aren't they? They're at a third the size. Bess Heath's loving the reverse. And she's finding another boundary. We know good, tight, hard bowling are your chance here, but as evenly poised because uh, we know this wicket is very, very good and 100 plus in the next 10 overs is certainly possible. She's thrown a fair bit at that, but not got a hold of it. And Coit takes an excellent catch. She's having quite the match, Sarah Coit. Flintoff advances, chips it over the top, finds a gap, and Coit's desperation isn't enough. Sarah Coit gets her second. A hundred wickets in the WBBL, recalled to the lineup. An outstanding achievement. Full hearted player. That's a full blooded stroke. Beautifully played by Sutherland. Passed over. Down the ground goes Sutherland. Didn't get all of it, but does find the rope. Sutherland now. Out through mid-wicket, all the way. Bang, bang. They're right back in this. Sutherland goes over the top of her. The line of the bat. Courtney Webb came up, and Sutherland. It's a good matchup for two right-handers, the off-spinner. Garth, reverse. Gets it fine. That is clever. It's racing away. It's four. 21 off the over. The innings bowl those tough overs. She's got that very firmly through the infield. That races out to the boundary. She's a scoring machine, Annabelle Sutherland. Garth gives herself room. Gets it through. Out to the boundary. Garth didn't want to go there, was forced into it, and Hayward takes the catch, and Coit's got three for. Such a good bowling performance. Sutherland high down the ground. She's got it all. What a strike from Sutherland. What an exhibition of batting. She goes again. She's hit seven. She's hit four sixes. She brings up her 50. Looks like Sophie Molyneux's hurt herself here. Nine off three, Molyneux is down. She goes after that. Can Webb get it? No! 
This is enormous from Annabelle Sutherland. The mightiest of batting performances that might just prove, it, prove to be match winning. Fulton in the air over the top. The Stars have done it. Fulton hits the winning runs, but Annabelle Sutherland, what a heroic performance from her. Just brilliant. They keep their season alive, the Melbourne Stars, and they have her to thank.